Hello audience, my name is Anna. Editor Anna would like to welcome you for visiting Health Fitness 1047 and here is the official news that follow up. 1. Copy Kia Re. Kriti Sanan trolled for copying Ashwarya Ray's crazy Kia Re moves in Dupati song Akianda Cole Kriti Sanan is facing accusations of copying Ashwarya Rai Bachchan after her recent performance in the song Akianda Cole from her upcoming film Dupati. In this film, Kriti plays a double role, portraying both the sweet Samawa and her fun-loving twin Shaylee. The song features Kriti in a striking red latex catsuit, but her dance moves, particularly a hook step, have drawn comparisons to Ashwarya's iconic choreography in Crazy Kia Re. The film also stars Kajol as a cop and marks TV star Shahir Sheikh's Bollywood debut. 2. I started slow and picked up gradually. Actor Baron Sabdi on his showbiz journey Baron Sabdi an actor who transitioned from a corporate career to showbiz, reflects on his gradual journey in the industry. He began with minimal preparation, learning acting and filmmaking on the job. Sabti's first role was in the 2009 TV show, Shraddha, after which he gained fame in Is Pyar Ko Kya Nam Doon, and later showcased his talent in web series like Kora and Asur. He acknowledges that his early work was not strong, attributing it to his slow start and a tendency to underestimate the preparation needed for acting. 3. Ashwarya Rai attends cousin's birthday bash with Aradhya amid divorce rumors. Abhishek Bachchan gives it a Miss Ashwarya Rai attended her cousin Sagar Shetty's birthday party with her daughter Aradhya, while her husband Abhishek Bachchan was absent. Despite ongoing speculation about their marriage, the couple has remained silent on the matter. A family photo from the event has sparked mixed reactions on Reddit, with some users praising Ashwarya and Aradya's simplicity, while others discussed the normalization of failed marriages. 4. Want to talk teaser? Abhishek Bachchan announces his next film with Shujit Sarkar. Abhishek Bachchan has announced his upcoming film, I Want to Talk, directed by Shujit Sarkar. Set to release in theaters on November 22, he shared a teaser on X, formerly Twitter, featuring a bobblehead of himself and his voice discussing the importance of communication in life. The teaser highlights his unique role in the film. 5. Sanam Kapoor, Ananda Huja by Nirav Modi's shuttered iconic music store Rhythm House in Mumbai for 478 million rupees bond group. Owned by Sanam Kapoor and Ananda Huja, is purchasing the iconic Rhythm House music store in Mumbai for 478.4 million rupees, 5.7 million dollars. The store which has been closed since 2018 due to financial issues involving its previous owner, Nirav Modi, is 3,600 square feet in size. The sale was overseen by a resolution professional appointed by the Indian Bankruptcy Court, and the transaction has been approved by the Stakeholder Committee. 6. Babita Fogat reveals her family was paid only 1 crore rupees for Amir Khan's dangle. Makers wanted to change character names Nitesh Tiwari's film, Dangle, co-produced and starring Amir Khan. Grossed approximately 2,000 crore rupees globally and is based on the Fogat family. Despite the film's success, Babita Fogat revealed in an interview that her family received only 1 crore rupees for the rights to their story, which amounts to less than 1% of the film's total earnings. Seven. Kiera Advani Siddharth, Shahid Kapoor Mira, Varun Natasha bring Bollywood romance to Manish Malhotra's Diwali party at Manish Malhotra's Diwali party in Mumbai. Bollywood celebrities including Kiera Advani, Siddharth Malhotra, 
Shahid Kapoor, Mira Rajput, Varun Dewan, and Natasha Dalal were in attendance. Kiera dazzled in a golden outfit, while Shahid and Mira coordinated in white and silver. Other attendees included Karen Johar, Shraddha Kapoor, and Arjun Kapoor. Rekha wore a vibrant orange, yellow, and golden sari. And Siddharth chose a maroon kurta with white pajama. 8. Diwali 2024 kicks off with Manish Malhotra's annual party. Alia Bhatt, Kiera Advani, Suhana Khan bring the sparkles several celebrities. Including Alia Bhatt, Ananya Pandey, Gauri Khan, Kiera Advani, and Shahid Kapoor attended Manish Malhotra's Diwali party. Alia Bhatt wore a patchwork pink lehenga, the same outfit from her Mahendi function last year. Tamana Abadia dazzled in a red sari with a velvet blouse, while Kajol opted for a red shimmery co ord set. Kusha Kapila also made an impression in a stunning pink sari with a beautiful border. 9. Suhana Khan, Janvi Kapoor, Ananya Pandey, Alia Bhatt. Kajol attend Manish Malhotra's Diwali Bash in traditional outfits Alia Bhatt, Kajol, and several other celebrities attended a Diwali party hosted by fashion designer Manish Malhotra in Mumbai. Alia wore her Mahendi lehenga with big earrings and a bun hairstyle, while Kajol chose a shimmery outfit. Other attendees included Gauri Khan, Suhana Khan, Janvi Kapoor, Shilpa Shetty, Ananya Pandey, Vijay Varma, and Kriti Sanan, all dressed in traditional attire. 10. Karen Johar, Adar Punawala put up a united front after Dharma Productions deal at Manish Malhotra's Diwali Bash. Karen Johar recently sold a 50% stake in his production company, Dharma Productions, to Adar Punawala, CEO of Serum Institute of India, for 1,000 crore rupees. Following the sale, both Karen and Adar attended a Diwali party hosted by fashion designer Manish Malhotra, where they appeared together, showcasing a united front despite the social media buzz surrounding the deal. They were joined by Dharma Productions CEO Apoorva Mehta at the event. 11. Nina Gupta says her ex-boyfriend used to ask money to buy cigarettes. Thank God Shadi Nahi Ki, Nina Gupta shared her experiences from the early days of her acting career, revealing that she took on odd jobs, including working at a cafe. In hopes of being noticed by directors. In an interview with Siddharth Kanan, she recounted how she had moved to Mumbai with her ex-boyfriend, who was unemployed and relied on her for money. Gupta also mentioned that her ex-boyfriend mocked her for her cafe job, highlighting the challenges she faced during that time. 12. Ranbir Kapoor and Katrina Kaif starrer Ajib Prem Ki Ghazab Kahani to re-release in theaters on this date the 2009 romantic comedy, Ajib Prem Ki Ghazab Kahani, starring Ranbir Kapoor and Katrina Kaif, is set to re-release in theaters on October 25. The announcement was made by the producers, Tips Films, who aim to bring the film's charm back for both nostalgic fans and a new generation of viewers. This film marked the first collaboration between Kapoor and Kafe.